I foresee the day where no event is unexpected. Where are we now with regard to NOAA's modeling and other agencies modeling and things just happening, taking everyone by surprise? There's a really interesting aspect to your question, Neil, because um, there's a famous story in meteorology. It's called Isaac Storm. In fact, Eric Larson wrote a great book on Isaac Storm, and it was a hurricane that hit Galveston in the year 1900. For the folks in Galveston in 1900, that storm was an unexpected storm. They didn't expect it to hit. Now, obviously, there's never going to be another Isaac Storm. We've improved that. There are things, though, that happen on much shorter time scales. And so I would say they may not be unexpected, like tornadoes. Right now, for tornadoes, we're looking at an average lead time on most tornadoes of about 12 minutes. About 50 years ago, the lead time on tornadoes was minus five minutes. Okay, Think that doesn't that. even make any sense. Oh, <laughs> I'm just saying, when the tornado's over, I already know there was a tornado. <laughs> That's right. There is something wrong with that picture. By the way, 12 minutes, 15 minutes is enough time to get out of the way of a tornado. Or, or to go, yeah, or to or go underground. Yeah, underground. Yeah, right. yeah. So that's, an in, that's yeah. incredible. 